Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are back in Sprocket yet again, and today we're going to be trying to build a really light tank. Now, the closer I get to 1 tons, the better this tank is going to be for me. Now, it is worth saying this tank will be useless if that is the case, uh, but that's what we're going to attempt to do. So, let's just go ahead and try and build a 1 ton tank. Let's do it. Alright, so clearly we start with things that are way, way, way too big. This is literally mahusive, and uh, it doesn't help us at all because of how big it is. So, we're going to go ahead and make it a lot smaller, and hopefully we can deal with that. So let's go ahead and drop this guy down, go ahead and make it skinnier, and there we go. I might actually try and make this thing look quite cool too, because I think that's probably a good option. But yeah, so far we currently weigh 6 tons. That is way, way, way too much. So, we're going to go ahead and do this, do this, do this, go ahead and get rid of the rollers. Actually, we don't want those. Uh, we want to make this as small as we possibly can. Okay, cool. That seems to make sense to me. Uh, we're then going to make everything really, really tiny, uh, which hopefully helps as well. I'm assuming it will. There we go. And uh, we're going to make these guys really small too. So, the diameter of these guys, 0.2. There we go. Excellent. And the diameter of the idler as well is going to be the same. 0.2, bam, there we go, okay, that's kind of cool, that is kind of cool, so if we can, we're going to go ahead and make these all fit together, uh, whether this is going to work or not, I'm not so sure, anyway, width of the tracks, 0.2, bam, there we go, and we're going to have to make everything else super skinny as well, because that's kind of how it works, anyway, length of these guys, tiny, diameter of those guys, tiny, rest angle, mm, I guess actually, that'll do, Scale of them, really, really small, and adjust it so that it's actually inside and working. There we go. All right, fantastic. So far, so good. Can I move this guy backwards? I can't. That seems very strange, but I guess four wheels is fine. There we go. Good. Okay, so let's go back to layout. Separation, that needs to come in. And uh, we should have a good-looking tank out of this. Yeah. Okay, sick. Okay, so we still weigh 2.4 tons, but uh, we can change that a little bit. Uh, because if we go to this, we can actually lower this down, say it only has 10 liters of fuel or whatever, and that has lowered the weight a lot. Apparently the armor is actually uh, weighs a lot too, so let's go to the armor, select all, and make it all, uh, my, yeah, 5. Okay, 5 millimeters. That's insane, but sure. We're then going to bring this guy backwards to there, that's okay. And it's quite cool, okay. This is what we currently have. Nice. Okay, what else is weighing too much? Apparently, there is a bunch of is weighing too much, but we're going to go ahead and lower this down so it's really tiny. 0 0.5 on there as well. Hopefully, this will move us along. It is, what, like a one liter engine? That seems to make sense. Uh, we still weigh too much. We still weigh far too much. Apparently, the tracks are actually um, to do with that. So, length of these guys, I guess less. Thickness already is as thick as, or as thin as it can go. So we just need less tracks. How do I get less tracks? I can't seem to move this guy backwards, and I can't move this guy forwards. So I guess length of this needs to be squidged. Oh, there we go. That's how we do it. Okay, excellent. So let's say we have these guys. I'm going to go ahead and make the road wheel in the middle a lot tinier. And that's going to make our weight come all the way down, actually. So road wheels, make that a lot smaller. Oh, it doesn't quite fit. There we go. Okay, sick. And that's pretty cool. I would say that's that's good. Yeah. Okay, so straight to compartments. Let's go ahead and squidge this guy backwards all the way to about there. Go ahead and squidge this guy forwards all the way to about here. And that's it. There we go. Sick. Oh, I should say as well, actually, we need to get rid of a bunch of the crew. We need a commander, which is also a gunner, loader, and a driver. Uh, they need to do all of the jobs because that is their job. So there you go. Go back to compartments. Let's go ahead and squidge this forwards. Um, what we'll do is... We'll actually go to the top of this and bring it down like so. And we'll bring this guy slightly up. And then what we'll do is extend this. Squidge it a little bit. Here we go. And bring it this way as well. There we go. Okay, so slightly rounded on the front. I just want it to look nice. <laughs> That's kind of all I want. Um, but there you go, we are under a ton so far. This is excellent. Apparently the engine is still 41% of this, but I guess that makes sense. So, yeah. Okay, let's add a driver's port and see if we can see. Uh, View bots, here we go. Let's go ahead and just shove this directly on there. Ah, 
This is a problem that we come up against quite often, actually. Um, it gets stuck straight away, and I don't know how to deal with that. So we can't. We actually can't deal with that. But there you go. Anyway, we need a gun. So, firepower? Yes. Mantlet? Yes. One of these guys? Alright, again, I did want it to look nice originally, but it can't, so never mind. There we go. Whack that on there. We are now 1.13. 1 1.13. Uh, length of this is going to be tiny. The caliber is going to be 47 millimeters. There we go. And the length of the propellant, way less. There we go. One ton. 1 1.1 tons. Uh, okay, cool. Cool indeed. Alright, this is, this is interesting. Uh, goodness sight, let's go ahead and grab one of those and try and smash it on here like, like this. But, what we'll do is we'll bring it forwards so it's like matching with that one. So hopefully we can see. Okay, yes. <laughs> it kind of works. Good. Um, we have a space issue, of course. Our crew is taking up 500% of the space. I don't know how they've managed that, but... They are, so there you go. We've only got one crew member, so I really don't know how that's going on. But sure, we'll, we'll stick with that for now. That's fine. Anyway, compartments. Uh, leave those guys as they are. Mobility. Fenders. Auto-generate. They are way too big. Uh, go ahead and, I guess, make the length of them way tinier. And squidge them in. If we can. Squidgy, squidgy. Hold on, how do I do this? Separation, bring it in. There we go. Go ahead and lift it up until it fits. So height up to about there. There we go. And <laughs> this is so dumb. Uh, front, let's grab one of these guys. Make that way smaller because it needs to. And angle it, I guess, like that. There you go. Width of this guy is going to be way smaller as well, just like so. And looks good to me. This is our tank, guys. What do we think? Oh, actually, that's not it. That is not the only thing that we need. Let's go to crew. Crew hatches. No, 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 no. Commander's cupola. Yes. Let's go ahead and make this really tiny. Uh, and shove that on there as well. Because it, it needs to be on there. So there you go. That's the way for the guy to get in and out of the vehicle. Bam. Okay, sick. I am I'm excited to see how this works. <laughs> I'm assuming it's not going to. But we'll see. Okay, next thing then is firepower. Yes, ammo storage. Yes, let's go ahead and shove these guys. Oh my goodness, into there. We're going to have not that many rounds, actually. We're probably not going to be able to fire that many, so no point in putting in loads. And they can just go to the front like so. Don't know how our weight has just dropped, but it has, so that's good. Um, there you go. Okay, next thing then. I want to go ahead and make the outside look a little bit prettier. And we could go from there. Yes. Let's have a box on the back. Obviously, you need a box. I mean, why wouldn't you have a box on the back, you know? Let's go ahead and make it wider so that it fits in there. And everything else needs to fit, too. All right, here we go. Lights. Camera. Action. Two lights. Whacked right there. Uh, the rear lights uh, we can't actually have because they can't fit anywhere. Unless they go here. Actually, I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to move them up. No, 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 no. I'm going to move them up. I don't want to make them chunkier. I just want them there. Okay, fantastic. Yes. We have front and rear lights. Do we need a spade? Oh my, the spade is as big as the... Okay, there's going to have to be a child driving this, I'm not going to lie. Uh, which doesn't seem very ethical, but that does mean we can have a child size, <laughs> A child size sleeping bag as well. There we go. Okay, good. I'm ready. We're ready for war. Uh, livery. Let's go ahead and go with the one that we always go with. Um... Here we're going to make it more blue. Actually, we're not. We're not. We're going to stick with this. Brightness, quite high. There we go. Okay, I'm ready for war, guys. I'm ready to go. Let's go. I can't drive. It gets stuck straight away. This is its issue. It gets stuck in between the two tracks. That's crazy. Alright guys, we're gonna go in and see if this actually works. So, <laughs> there is ten of us versus three of the enemies. Um, <laughs> look at us go! Yes! Oh, this is amazing! Yeah, the enemies are gonna annihilate us, but also, we are so low to the ground, they're not gonna be able to see us. This is great. Alright, so, first problem uh, that I can encounter, or that I think I will encounter, is that I might not be able to get over the train tracks. Uh... I feel like that might be a massive issue. Also, I can't see any of my... Oh, there they are. My friendly tanks. Oh, am I going to get over this? <laughs> no way! I can't get over the tracks! Guys, I can't! I 
can't even get over the tracks. Let's see if that guy can. All right, I need to get a different tank because that one's stuck. <laughs> this is this is crazy. Okay, I'm hoping this will work. I don't know whether it will. Oh, I've never really seen any sort of. Oh, oh, oh! What do no? I got all the way to here. Also, I've never seen this map glitch out like this before, but it is glitched out. Oh, that guy's. Wait, that guy's gone. That guy. I need to be that guy. Ha he's just leaving. Hey, which one is he? He's this one. Right, he's on the other side of the tracks. All right, it might actually be one versus three. I don't know how this is gonna go. Okay, apparently, uh, oh, there's an enemy gonna shoot me in the butt. Okay, I need to watch out here. Let's go ahead and aim towards the enemy. I might need to be driving to actually shoot him, but <laughs> here we go. Okay, let's drive in. Oh, I hit a rock. No, that's bad. Reverse out of his view. Oh, I didn't manage to do it. He's turned all the way around. <laughs> I feel like I'm a ro remote control car. All right, skid. Oh, yikes. Okay, we need to drive towards the enemy. And fire. Oh, yikes. Okay, aim up. Aim up into the side and fire. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get through this. Okay, aim further backwards. Fire. I can't do it. Okay, reverse. Go this way. Yes. We're gonna shoot him in the bum instead. Hopefully this will work. Okay, ready? No. Ah, he shot me! Hey! <laughs> oh, I just drove through his tracks. That's weird. Okay. Oh, this isn't working. What do we do? Oh, I just accidentally switched tanks. Oh, this isn't good. All right, hang on. We need to get to the one that is underneath the... Oh, my. It's not even just underneath the enemy anymore. It's just in the air. Okay, that's dead. Yikes. Okay, we need another tank. Full speed. I don't know how that guy crossed the track so easy. I need to do that. Okay, so, so far we have lost two tanks and the enemy is uh, upon us. However, we might be able to get across the tracks of this guy and maybe we'll do a little bit of damage. I mean, we might have to change the gun because the gun seems pretty bad, but uh, I don't know. Anyway, I might have to go over this like angled. Oh, okay, yeah, maybe that angle. That's what I meant. Uh-oh. I got stuck straight away. This is not right. Okay, idea. We actually need to modify this thing uh, to have a better gear ratio. Guys, I've modified it. Oh, my goodness. Okay, right. This is... Uh, the gear ratio is not amazing like that, actually. Also, I've made the gun a little bit longer and the propellant length a little bit longer to hopefully make it work a little bit better, but it didn't quite work. Anyway, let's go ahead and raise this to two, because that's what we need, and two here as well. We still weigh about a ton, so that's good, and we do actually move now. Yes! Okay, I'm going to charge up this hill, try and kill this guy first, and then we're going to go for the other guys as well. This is crazy. Hey, come here, you. He just started reversing away. I don't know why. Oh, now he's coming in, and now he's reversing again. Okay, I don't know what this guy's doing. I'm going to get him, though. I'm going to get you, buddy. You're not, you're not even going to see what's coming. Oh, he does. He sees what's coming. Death. That's what he sees. I didn't kill him. I thought that would kill him, but it didn't. Ow! He shot me! Charge! 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 The enemy! Oh, I missed. I missed. Okay, hang on. Oh! Oh! He's running me over! Oh, yikes. Okay. Drive! Turn! Turn! Fire! I got it! <laughs> oh, it's me versus all the enemies. I got this. I got this. I ain't a loser. Come up here. Come up here. You won't. He's coming up here. I'm scared. I got him. I got him. Okay, where's the other ones? <laughs> one versus three. Okay, technically it was like a one versus five. But I've got two of them, so that's good. Oh, there's another one down there. Hide behind the tree. And drive forwards. Where is he? There he is. Shoot him. I got him. Yes. Who's next? Woohoo! Who would have thought this would work? <laughs> Look at me go. <laughs> no. Okay, right. There is. Oh, of course he's over there. He's 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 being he's being a bum. This guy. Being a butt face. Oh. Oh. No. No. Turn. Oh, I've fallen into the tracks. Oh no. Oh no. It's not even him. It's him. Oh, drive. Quick! Super speedy! No! Can't shoot me because I'm so fast! Yes! Hide behind this guy, maybe that guy will kill this guy. That'd be great. It's not gonna happen though. 
Okay. I'm being eaten by the tank. I can't move. I'm being eaten up. Help me. Okay, there we go. Okay. I'm gonna drive past you. Bad idea. I'm gonna go the other way. <laughs> gonna go the other way. One second. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. Aim towards the tank. I hit him, but he didn't die. Also, this guy's turned around. Uh-oh. Oh, no. What a predicament. I'm stuck. Ah! <laughs> oh, he's on fire. I did set him on fire. Okay, turn. And fire. No. Maybe we can track him. Maybe we can track him. Okay, I've got a few rounds left. I got this. Track the guy. Three, two, one. It didn't track him. It went straight through his tracks. I don't know how that happened. Okay, turn. Aim at this guy. He doesn't seem to be aiming anymore, so I think we're good. Three, two, one. There we go. He's dead. Now it's just me and you, big boy. Me and you. I'm going to have to try and drive around into his bum and shoot him in his bum. That's what I need to do. Oh, he's actually turning me with him because I can't move. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Stop. Stop. We're stuck in an end of cycle. We're stuck. No. Yes. Yes. Okay, drive. Oh, he's so quick at turning. I need to track him. Turn. Turn and shoot. Doesn't even matter. Oh, there we go. He didn't like that. <laughs> he didn't like that. What are you doing now? Oh, he's showing me... He's showing me his rear. I've set him on fire. Oh, yes. Yes, yes. No. Have I run out of fuel? <laughs> I think I've run out of fuel. I think I've run out of fuel. Three, two, one, fire. Oh, oh, no, I haven't. I haven't. I'm still moving. Oh, yeah, I've still got 10 litres of fuel. That's more than enough. Get up the hill. Come on. It's me versus the boss guy, and the boss guy's running away from a one-ton tank. Oh, this is a ridiculous fight. Okay, stop. And then we need to drive. No, okay, I'm falling down the hill. Okay, there we go. Drive. No. Drive. No, come on! Go. No, there's no way I'm getting up the hill with this. I can't give up, though. I'm not giving up. Turns out reversing might be the way up the hill. Here we go. Where's he gone? He's drove off all the way up there. Okay, right. Now turn sideways. Drive this way. Oh, we've made it. We, we're going to make it up. Are we? I'm sort of sliding down. Ah. Come on. Come on. I'm going to make it. Yes. Okay. We're up the hill. We need to fight him now. Let's go. He side on to me. I don't think I've got that many rounds. In fact, I think I'm only on my last shot. I think I've literally got one shot left. And what can I do with this one shot? I could take him out. I could do it. All right, let's get behind. Find a vulnerable location. It's rear. And just shoot it. Three, two, one. Is he going to die? Because I, I don't have anything to reload. I'm just dead, aren't I? Oh, what a shame. We tried our best and it we just didn't succeed, guys. I mean, also, they didn't succeed because they were the ones ambushing. But, yeah. I'm alive. <laughs> I'm alive. This is amazing. All right. Well, anyway, uh, I think we're going to end this video here for now. I had a lot of fun in this video. So, if you guys want to see more videos like this one... Let me know in the comments down below. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.